As it beats the Zubats, Jalen Duran are ready to get this one underway. Duran is an absolute beast in his second year for the Pistons. We'll talk about him a little bit later on. This is when the tackle after the start of the fourth quarter. Jade 90, as hot as anybody in the league, gets it to Duran. And if it's a Zubat, says better luck next time. How about our rim protect? That is a little dribble routine to try and gain some space from the defender. Got enough for a clean look. He was just 3 for 15 against the Pelicans on Wednesday. Open. Zoo on Muscala, up, under, sideways, and around, off the window, and in Ballerino's feet for Avicii Zubats. But I gather Detroit's liked Fontecchio for a while, not only because he could make shots, don't judge it by the last one, but he defends as well. Zoo with the floater, knocks it down, and it's good to see Avicii Zubats back. He's got four, Clippers lead by five. The ball challenged the shot. To his credit, Cunningham made the shot tough one. Cunningham, one of over 50 players, averaging 20 points a contest. Zoom misses short. Remember when we turned it around back in Detroit, it was the pressure defense that forced turnovers that led to easy scores. Duran deep inside, stymied by Zoo, but covered by George, ahead to Leonard. Duran. And Zoo with a rebound, hands to Terrence. Clippers just 6 of 23 from the three-point line. Detroit 7 of 16. Ivy the floater. Zoo the rebound. But a lot of shots on goal for Detroit. 60. George steps behind the three-point line. Knocks down the tray. 18 for George. That's the game's high water mark. One free throw attempt for Detroit. But they're making everything they shoot. And they battled back from down 23 to the Blazers a couple of nights ago. Muscala did a good job, Zara. Fontecchio not shy to shoot in a piston uniform. Misses there and Zoo with another rebound for the Clippers. And if you don't play harder than they are, you will have problems. And that's where the Clippers are right now. And I remember you mentioning a stat and had to do it rebounds. 17 more rebounds. That's a lot. All of the things that have happened in the eight previous wins for the Pistons are happening tonight. Bench outscoring the opposition. Tip your cap to the Pistons. They gave it their all. They actually led by as many as 13. Clippers will hold on. They went small, and the lead got big. 112-106 is the final. The Clippers are winners.